video number four. Athletes have jogged over from the balance beam to floor, and we start with 25 double jumps. Obviously, this is for punching and air time. Pointing the toes, full extension, locked knees. Okay, then we go over here, and we have roll back, arms go forward, up. Do it one more time, keep the arms in front as you roll forward. So you're using the hamstrings and the core. Then we have punch front up and back. And obviously as much sticking as possible, choreograph the arms as you see fit, arms overhead to front and front. All right. Then we have handstand snap down rebounds. All of this is to increase that straight leg punching, locked knees, good body shapes. Notice as little pike as possible turning upside down. And then right into fast feet. As quick as possible getting off their feet. Air time is created by leaving the floor as quickly as possible. This is for shaping, and when we set this up at the beginning of workout, each athlete sets up the entire floor, vault, bars, and beam with all of the tools that are needed to complete this circuit so there's no stopping. That's why if you notice on the PowerPoint in parentheses, it lists what they need to set up to have everything they need for each of the circuits. This is for shaping. This is a favorite of Tammy Biggs to work on the shape and the active stomach upon landings. Front and back. And then we just enhance this exercise by doing squats. And when they do the squats, the emphasis is on pressing down with your legs and your hips and your arms press through to absorb the landing, especially now that we use so many of the connections out of the double backs.